So we're actually under a bridge here. It's not too old, maybe 25 years old. And uh, they concreted into the bedrock here. But looking at the bedrock, there's areas that are mineralized like this. You can see the oxidation there. There's some mineralization there. We're just gonna take a moment to hammer some of the bedrock and see what we can find here. So you got disseminated iron pyrite, the silicious rock. A bit more there, but you also have some zinc in the form of sphalerite. So it's nothing crazy, but it is found uh, disseminated through the rock pretty evenly with the iron sulfides. I'd say if you ran this for an assay, you'd get about maybe 1% zinc. And that's just right here in this gossinous area. That's very loose and brittle. And this bridge is sitting on top of this. <laughs> You can see the oxidation there on the bedrock. Even over there. So this is built on a uh, gossinous area with sulfides, pyrite and sphalerite. I don't know if it uh, will ever affect the bridge, but I wouldn't be building a bridge on top of a mineral deposit, especially when you got big logging trucks going over here and everything. What do you guys think? Leave a comment in the comment section. Let me know if uh, you would ever do something like this. You think they'd have engineers who would design where to actually put the bridges?